Thanks for being here. Just want to say to our team, Team 144, all glory to God. It was a mission. It had lofty aspirations and, and high goals, and we never lost sight of it. We never lost sight of those goals. We, we never lost sight of the mission. We completed the mission. And I want to thank all of you, all of you, for coming out here tonight. You're weathering the storm, just like the 2023 Michigan football team weathered the storm. I want to bring up one of our great captains and great players, Chris Jenkins. How y'all doing today? That's what I'm talking about. It's an honor to have y'all out here tonight with us to celebrate Michigan being national champions! Y'all don't know how much we appreciate y'all from the bottom of our heart, from the bottom of our hearts, all the love and support y'all have from us from day one. When the whole world doubted us, when the whole world didn't think we could do it, guess what we said? And all the guys who came back, man, from the coaches, the staff, the players, everybody who soaked everything, all the hard work, all the blood, sweat, and tears into this. We said we had some unfinished business. Guess what? Finish, man! Let's go, baby! Want to get uh, Jesse Minter and Sharon Moore. I want to bring up somebody who needs no introduction. A man who has run himself into the history books. He needs no introduction. Blake Cobb! Man, oh man. I just want to say we appreciate y'all from the bottom of my heart. Great job, Mikey. Thank you. Another captain, linebacker, Michigan's won 1,004 games. No team has won more in high school, college, or pro football. And there's one Michigan Wolverine who has won the most games, player who's been part of the most wins in Michigan history, 63 wins. Captain Mike Barrett. Man, it's a great opportunity to come out here, man. It's a blessing to be a part of this organization, man, to be here with all these guys. You know what I mean? Love y'all boys, man. It's been a long ride, man, but we had to come home with the dub, man. We had to do it for y'all. Love y'all, man. Hey, like you said, go! Blue! Go! Blue! Who's got it better than us? No! Hey! I took the words right out of my mouth. Who's got it better than us? No! Hey! All right. Number number nine in the program. Number one in your heart, JJ McCarthy. Man, I just want to thank every single one of y'all for everything. Hey, let's enjoy this one tonight. We'll worry about that, but hey. It's just everything about this place just made it home for me, and I just love every single one of y'all from the bottom of my heart. And it's all about the team, the team, the team here. You guys are included. You guys are the team, so we appreciate you so freaking much. I love you guys. Go Blue! Fantastic. Beautiful. I just want to thank everybody, all the players on the team, all the coaches, all the staff, our administration, Ward Manual, our president, Santa Ono, and the entire Wolverine Army, the man army, to across the world, 
And I want to hope everybody comes out. We're planning a big celebration on Saturday. Dave Abel, everyone, tell us about that celebration. Dave. City of Ann Arbor. We will have more details about that tomorrow once it is finalized, so be ready. It might be cold, there might be snow, but we want everybody to show up for this parade. And then, and then on Saturday night at 7 o'clock, we want everyone to come out. Well, you got to buy some tickets to this event. This is going to be an event that's going to be uh, with the collective, the Champion Circle Collective. We're uh, going to have everyone at Chrysler Center at 7 p.m. It's going to be televised by the Big Ten Network. We hope everyone can come out. We're excited about it. Go Blue! Thank you, thank you. Love you all. Nothing but love. All love. Go Blue! Got one more announcement for y'all before y'all go. We go in the red! Thank you.